scammer fake guru or legit dropship mentor? Let's find out. All right, so today we're gonna to be taking a look at Raman Popal, scammer, guru, fake guru. Where does he fall on the spectrum? So I like to vet all these things and I've spent probably a couple hundred dollars now on his stuff. And there's some exchanges between us I'll read. <laughs> I feel bad because as soon as I do, he's gonna know who it is. And he's gonna kick me out of his little discord. But to be honest, uh, it doesn't really matter. So let's just get right into it. 377,000 followers, blue check mark, claims he makes, you know, uh, he's made $4 million in online sales, which I gotta be honest, that's really not all that much. I'm not sure $4 million really qualifies you to be a guru to know the ins and outs. And I'm starting to find a lot of these guys that, you know, oh, let me help you make 10,000 a month with e-com or, you know, let me get you there, this or that. Like they're barely there themselves. And I wouldn't say they're there because they're gurus. I'd say they cracked a little bit of luck, right? So if you go looking through a lot of his stuff, um, it's like all those influencer flexes. Like, oh, look at me, I'm eating dinner. Oh, look at me, I'm driving in a nice car that I rented. Or maybe, oh, look at me, I'm smoking with fish. Eh, he's living the Instagram lie life, you know? It's just kind of a lot of bullshit. I don't really see assets in his name. I see a lot of, like, bathroom pictures with a Gucci belt and some bullshit, right? And, you know, like, oh, I'm walking in France with Ferraris. Maybe they're mine. Maybe they're not. Oh, I'm flying first class. Oh, me and all my boys. Uh -huh. Um... <laughs> <laughs> you know, pretty much anybody can do that. It, it, it doesn't take that much to do all that. But then again, like maybe that's the lifestyle the guy wants to live. You know, he's got a clean haircut, nice looking guy. He's out having some fun. So he's spending a few bucks. But to be perfectly honest, it's hard to vet how much of this is his. So when I looked it all over and his ad came up to like, hey, check me out. Let me help you make some e-commerce. I've been looking at e-commerce and, you know, it's fairly expensive to get started. I just like vetting these guys anyway. When it came across as try my free AI store builder. I thought, well, hell free, free is pretty good to, to vet someone. Right. But with 377,000 followers, he gets 241 likes and 18 comments. Um, I'm not, I can't remember what the ratio was. They said it was like normal, but you can tell if someone's faking, you know, I mean, for 377,000 followers with only 108 posts, that means like your posts are just fan fucking tastic. Like ew, the engagement's pretty low. And nothing against him. He's got more engagement than me, but I'm not out here trying to be like, I'm some kind of guru influencer. I'm just talking about like, yo, I tried out this guy's program. It did or didn't help. Um, you know, follow me or don't like these guys are like, follow me. I'll show you the way I'm like, let me just see what's inside the other side. Let me show everybody else. So some of the biggest likes he got was like flexing in this car. That's not his right as long as you weren't one of them it doesn't matter how size your account he's got like this little motivational speech and all this little bullshit like i don't know anyway when i've talked to him though whether it's a bot or one of his paid i don't know virtual assistants you know the people that they hire from like other countries or stuff they've always been very polite right so i can't say that he's bullshit to any other degree other than what we're going to look at right now i think that he doesn't have the experience that he's claiming and that he probably shouldn't be teaching. And this is some of the reasons why. So let's just pop through it. So he's been paying for paid ads, but I can see where he's getting paid by Shopify and them to do this. And the store builder that he's talking about is it's fucking garbage. So you pop over to his website, right? That's off his link. You know, you take the little link over there to his AI store builder. And this is what got me. Right? I was just, you know, checking different dudes out. I'm like, well, shit, I'm shit for less than 10 minutes. What do I have to lose? Well, 200 bucks plus. So my AI software will build you a Shopify drop in your store and, Less than 10 minutes for 100% free. And I'm thinking, hmm, okay. Now he's like, important. This is your only chance to get a done-for-you store. But I've seen like 10 other dudes with this exact same splash page, this exact same everything. The only thing changed was like the video and the colors a little bit, right? So I'm like, somebody somewhere out there did an influencer program. They put together the kit and they reached out to these guys and said, hey, and it's, you know, somebody at Shopify. And they're saying, hey, here's our brand kit. You know, drop your brand kit in on top of this. You know, we'll give you X, Y, Z for bringing people through to the platform, right? We'll give them a free month to, to hook them in and we'll give you commissions afterwards, right? And I can tell you because this is exactly what every single other one says. It's just, you know, almost verbatim. It's just some people are charged a little more. Some people might charge for the first month. This guy did a totally free thing for the first month, whatever, right? But let's watch this little video for a second, okay? We'll chop this up. So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Now, firstly, the question that is probably running through your mind right now is, Ramin, how can you do this for free? And why is it free? And I'm going to answer that in just a second. Right. And it's like, how can you? Well, if you're making four million sales, I guess you're doing it from the love of your heart, right? If you're going to do that, make a better program. And you'll see in the exchanges between me and the DMs, like 
he's not doing this for anything other than the Shopify kickback. Now, my name is Ramin Popple, and I've been doing dropshipping for the last seven years. And dropshipping... Now, he says seven years, right? And he's made $4 million in sales in seven years. Handy dandy calculator, because you guys know how I love to look at Guru's numbers, right? So, if Homeboy's been doing this for seven years, and let's just take him at his word that he's honest, seven years, right? Call it 12 months. He's had 84 months with $4 million of sales divided by 84 months. He's only making $47,619 a month in sales. I don't really consider that a guru or anything other. Like, I make more than that in my one little store, my main business. Like, that's nothing to be like, oh, I'm so great at this. Like, it's kind of expected average. Like, that's pretty low, dude. That's probably a half a million dollars a year. That's the average for a business owner to break even almost. So if you think about the Shopify fees, the shipping fees, the kickbacks on the other side, how much you actually get, and I'll show you from what my store did uh, from this guy. He's only looking at taking home like eight to twelve percent profitability. The guy's only making like four or five thousand dollars a month. That's just not that great when you're talking about I'm gonna show you the way. Right? So it's just not all that good. So let's go back to that. This is and this is why he's doing this program, in my opinion, is because he has enough success that most people don't really know what the numbers mean. They're like, whoa, four million, that's a big number. Whoa, forty seven thousand, that's so much. Right, but forty seven thousand went to buying the product, destroying the product, shipping the product. That 47000 includes all of it, everything you brought in, the shipping and handling if it wasn't free, all the money. What we should be talking about is how much did you make after all your fees? Because bringing in $4 million and taking $4 million to make $4 million means you made zero. Who cares? Like, it's not what you make, it's what you keep. It has completely changed my life. I went from being broke, having no idea what I want to do with my life, dropping out of college, to now I'm 24 years old. I've done over $4 million. So he's 24 years old, but he's been drop shipping for seven years, right? The drop shipping wasn't even that good back then. So, I mean, wow, he must have been a total master at 17 of the drop shipping game. Wow, Raman's just the man. In sales online, I live in a $3.5 million apartment with a private lift in the room, a private driver. I get to do what he lives in. He doesn't own because right 3.5 million like go do the math on that he's only making about eight thousand dollars a month profitability if he's doing really good at forty seven thousand after fees commission splits and product costs right that's almost his entire fee to live there what i want when i want wherever i want and i get to travel around the world have fun and most importantly be able to take care of not only myself but my family and you guys can see my entire life on social media my Right, you can see his entire life on social media, the Gucci belt, the rented Rolex, the rented, you know, Rolls Royce, all the shit. So basically, he has a little bit of success, right? I'm not going to dog the guy, like, you don't know shit, you don't know nothing. Like, he's doing okay, but there's a reason why he's doing all this extra, because he's spending everything he makes. Plus, we're talking about ads. That doesn't even can include ads. Like, you got to drive traffic to your website on top of that. Like, this guy is just mediocrely successful. Instagram has over 300,000 followers. And I've been doing this for quite some time. And over the last couple of years, I've also been able to amass over 800,000 followers across social media platforms. And 800,000 followers and the guy can't get like 15 comments. And if you go inside and take him up on all this, get your free course and all that other stuff. And you go inside his discord, it's fucking dead. Like, you know, there's maybe you can scroll the page and there's a month's worth of conversation back and forth going on so i mean he's not really you know attracting anyone into the program or getting anyone going on it really teach tens of thousands of people tens of thousands no there's there's not tens of thousands of people on discord i challenge anyone to jump in there and see the actual conversations and then i want you to see how he answers too he always steers you right back to like this like i said he's really polite but it's like this third party steers you back to like hey did you try our uh our shark builder like well that costs money right? That, that isn't about this AI free done for you shit. Like the AI free done for you stuff is so garbage and so low end it's worth less. It's actually a disaster on how to get started with one of the greatest online business models out there, which is e-commerce dropshipping. Now I work very closely with Shopify and Shopify is where you host your online store. And I've been working very closely with them. And the reason I'm able to see them blinks, then blink. I've been working very closely. Like Every time he says a weird, like, offbeat thing, like, he starts blinking all hard out of his left eye. Well, to provide this for free is because Shopify is paying me 
to help you get started with e-commerce drop shipping. So there you go. They're paying him to get you started, right? So he gets you started with this dog shit garbage store, this AI builder that's absolute trash. It is the worst thing I've ever seen. You might as well just not even bother. Uh, it makes like a totally crooked store. It's wrong. And then when you call him out, he's like, oh, hey, did you jump into the into the course? And it's like, I don't want to pay you to do it. If I did that, I'd pay someone else who does more than $4 million in sales, right? I jumped into this because he's holding himself out as a guru who's done $4 million. I'm going to get it up for free. I'm going to get you going. Let me help you. But once you go down the road and spend the 10 minutes and a couple hundred bucks to get all signed up and locked in, because, uh, you know, you got to commit to that extra month. I mean, you, you can cancel in seven days, but... You know, you're not going to because you can't make any sales in seven days. Like, let's be realistic, right? You got to let, let it run for a couple months. So then you're locked in for like $69 a month. The products that it adds are garbage. The product cut is garbage. Like, you make less than half. Um, the descriptions on the products are so terrible and so, so unrealistic. Like, it's just absolute trash. It's the bottom of the barrel of the bottom of the barrel. And help you find success with it so if you're looking to make money online you're looking to be able to live that laptop lifestyle where you're able to work whenever you want wherever you want with whoever you want and be able to tap into this trillion dollar industry that is growing at a rapid rate every single year then you are in the right place now anyone can do this regardless of age experience background where you're from uh, literally, I started out and I failed high school pretty much. I dropped out of college. I didn't come from a rich family and I was able to go ahead and make it work. And the same goes with thousands of people that I've been able to help out. Now, e-commerce dropshipping is one of the greatest online business models that a beginner can start. Firstly, there is no upfront cost from your end pretty much uh, because inventory, you don't have to buy that upfront. The supplier will handle all that. So they'll pack, ship the product directly to the customer. Now, that's what I just said because the supplier is going to handle all that there's no inventory on your side right well you're still going to pay for warehousing but on their side and it's not going to be in the fact of like well got to charge a warehouse fee it's the fact that they're going to charge you 15 percent more for a product like a little you know squirt gun and bullshit whatever they have so a product that you probably could have brought in in bulk and paid me you know, like ms or if msrp was like 25 bucks you could probably bring them in for like five right so you got your markup you got your marketing you got your overhead and you might have three or four bucks of profit left these dudes are going to charge you 12 bucks instead of five bucks and they're going to take a fat cut for all the warehousing all the drop shipping the, the two products that i ordered from myself from the store they gave me came so terribly wrapped and they were not even really as described on the website uh, I would have asked for my money back. I would have dinged me on Shopify, right? Um, it was, it wasn't fast by any means either. Um, the shipping was astronomical. After like you know the, the stores you went to, the the uh, product maker says like, would you like to do free shipping? I'm, I said sure. So it sets the store up, right? Makes me a banner for free shipping and all this crazy shit. But then there's no option for that. The products that it shows in the store like don't match what the AI builder is giving you. It's very mismatched in general. But that's part of the thing though. So he's talking about, oh, I made 4 million. Well, if he's drop shipping 4 million as well, okay, at least 2 million went back to the people that dropped the product, had the product, right? And then he spent money on ads. So in seven years, the guy's barely made a normal wage job, possibly. And you only pay for the product where a customer places an order. There goes and blinks again. Second, you can see results super fast. So you get your store in less than 10 minutes and then you're ready to start generating sales for that store. And then also it's a growing industry. E-commerce growing at a rapid rate every single year, meaning that you're in a growing industry and not a dying industry. Now I've built this AI software over the last year. They'll build you a Shopify dropshipping store. He built this over the last year and I challenge you to go through it just for the fun of it and see what garbage it is. He should stick to dropshipping, not build an AI software in less than 10 minutes and alongside that it'll add in 20 trending products that have been hand selected by myself and my team you'll also get a supplier added to it a high quality the products were so fucking terrible and the stuff that it added was like chinese 99 cent store junk that if you did spend money trying to advertise nobody's gonna want that shit go take a look you'll see be reliable and a supplier they'll ship the products fast to your customers and on top of that i'm also going to give you exclusive access to a discord community free of a uh, free Discord community that's dead as fuck. And as soon as you go in there and complain, he says, why don't you join our paid Discord? Charge and thousands of dollars worth of training free of charge inside of Discord community as well. Now, sure, I could charge for all of this. In fact, I could charge $1,000 for what I'm providing to you guys. But Shopify has come through and they've 
allowed me to kind of go ahead and do all this for free because they're covering your cost at the end of the day. And this is great because you guys can get started with making money online and getting started with an online business. And I'm able to help you guys out with that. And you guys don't have to pay anything upfront out of your own pocket and get into this online business world space. That's who now see, that would be totally fantastic if the AI builder was any good. It's not, it's really bad. It'd be decent if the products that it suggested were actually trending products versus like this Chinese junk that, again, like the 99 cent store, it's, it's, it's trash the 99 cent store even for the most part. So, you know, you can keep ref refining like new products, new products, but nothing there is really good. It's nothing you jump on TikTok and be like, yo, I just got like this thing and it changed my life or, I mean, it's absolute trash. So when you go in and complain to him too, I'll read some of like our exchange between me and this guy. He's got your ads running to you out of that 2 million that he had left <laughs> and you hit start. And it's like, hey, I appreciate you reaching out, which is, you know, all the robot re reply. It says, before we chat, possibly about starting your own business, blah, blah, blah. Can I ask you some questions? And it's like, you know, where do you live? This stuff. And I say, yeah, I'm in the USA and I sell stuff. And he says, oh, okay, I gotcha. So I'm curious. What was it that made you interested in e comm in the first place? Was there a personal goal you've always wanted to achieve? It's like, you know, it's all coming off professional at first. Like if you've never done something or you're like someone who's like willing to take a risk, all the right things are being said, right? And you're like, cool, I'm going to step out and give this a shot. And what do I have to lose? It's free, like he said. And I just said, you know, I've done it before. I said, but e comm seems easier now than it was 10 years ago. And he said, I see. So tell me, what were your experiences doing e comm years ago? And I just said, not great. I already signed up um, in your Discord, but I'm locked out of everything in Discord. So it took him like four or five days from that point to even break it down so I could see stuff to verify me. Um, let's see. He said, were well, you doing that on your own with outside help? And I said, okay, I just watched your video, then did the 10 minute AI tutorial walkthrough and did what it told me. And he says, okay, gotcha. Just so I understand what's with your current situation made you want to try e comic after 10 years. And I said, I thought the, I, the auto AI might be better at building a successful business. Okay. Gotcha. Just to be on the same page. Are you looking for free resources or you're ready to really invest financially in yourself? Wow, he went through all this pitch, talked all this shit about how Shopify's backing him up. And this is where I'm getting ready to call him out, too, because his shit's garbage. So I said, um, just the free resources, but the way the presentation went, I expected it to actually work as said, but it didn't. He said, I see. The thing is, if you want to do that on your own, without the know-hows and without outside help and proper guidance, could be a problem. Dot, dot, dot. If you ever needed help setting up your recon business, you can reach out to us. Then the next thing he sent, because I didn't reply, would that help? Um, I did use your AI builder. Your video claimed it would handle it and do it well. Your video is not correct. He left me hanging for three months. February, March, oh, well, two months, right, to April. So I waited all that time just to see, because he's still actively posting. I said, I must, and I've talked to him in Discord, right, different names, so he wasn't sure who I was. I said, must have missed this. I did your free store builder, but was but it was a disaster of an AI build. He ignored me again for like two weeks. So he had some stories going about, if you want to start with free e-commerce, hit free. So I hit free to bring him back into the chat. And then I said, uh, except it's garbage, uh, except it's a garbage store, not even worth the free. So he replies, finally, our aim of the AI built store is really just to help people get started and get their foot in the door. They don't always have the best layout feature, etc., because they're built on AI in a general niche. A lot of the really good looking websites take weeks to develop. Um, okay. So basically your whole 10 minute pitch and get going in the building space and all this stuff. And you're being, you know, having your fees covered by Shopify is back to what bullshit. So now you're here, you're trying to tax stuff on the back. So he finally replies, so it's really just to help people get started. You can make certain customizations or adjustments to it as you see fit. Well, why would I want to go make customizations and adjustments to it if it's all fucked up from the from the ground up like it was an entire disaster and none of it was any good? So of course I can make customizations, but if it's the whole point I joined was for your free AI builder and it doesn't work, then why am I there? Like there's no reason for this. Obviously I'm not going to pay you for more so I can do more work. Like anyways... So, uh, I replied to him, let's see. Yeah. Basically it needs to be completely redone from scratch. AI stuff isn't even a good jump off point. He didn't even read the last one. He's ignored me for, you know, um, all the way up until now a month. So I'm sure when he sees this, I'll probably hear something from him, but if you're in his discord, it'll, it'll also pop you over. He's trying to move from discord to some other paid platform. Um, the free stuff's only going to last a little while longer. I mean, in general, he's, 
he's a really nice guy, but he's not a guru. He's definitely a scuzz bag. Um, he has a lot of misleading shit. And this is pretty much how that goes out from here for the last minute. Let's just play this out. To be honest, I do not know how long I can have this up for free just because of the immense value that we're providing. And the amount of people that are coming through is absolutely crazy. Like everyone is taking advantage of this, which is incredible to see. And I absolutely love that. But at a certain point, we're probably going to have to either stop this completely for six to eight months to be able to accommodate and handle the current students that are coming through, or we're going to have to start charging for this. So take advantage of this. Click the button down below. Get started. Uh, you know, there's never been a greater time in history to start an online business than right now. And a lot of you guys, there's literally no reason as to why you guys can't get started now. I'm giving you guys everything for absolutely free. I'm helping you guys out as much as possible. So yeah, click the button down below and I'll see you guys on the next page. So anyone that wants to try that out, you can try it out. But what happens is, is you end up going into filling out all the paperwork that has some questions, colors, you know, some real basic stuff. And it chops you together a store. It, it loads some really low end products. Like I said, I mean, I, I, I cannot reiterate enough how low end the stuff was that it loaded and just how terrible the store was put together in general. And you've already committed your credit card. You get like seven free days from Shopify. So by the time it's built and done, sure, it's done in 10 minutes. You go, you get pop into Discord. By the time you get approved, it's, you know, four days are gone. It's ticking. And then when you ask a question, he gives you the most in general response ever. Like I said, again, they're nice and polite, but in general bullshit. If I had a chance to do this again, I'd get my 140 bucks back. So I've let it uh, hit since February. So I paid uh, March, April. May, I guess I'm about to pay a third payment right now on Shopify. And I've had a Shopify, a Shopify store before and I did okay on there, but I built everything from scratch and it was a lot of work. Like he said in the DMs, oh, that could take weeks. Well, no shit, Sherlock, it could take weeks. But if you're claiming AI is so amazing, it can do it in 10 minutes. I think the thing you should say though is that my AI software will build you a shitty, almost useless Shopify drop shipping store in less than 10 minutes. And it will load it with garbage products that no one would ever buy, no matter how good your marketing was, for free. Because that would actually be the truth on Mr. Roman Papil. And as far as I'm concerned, this is all bullshit. This is written stuff. Um, yeah, pretty much, like I said, nice guy, but total faker. I don't see anything in here anywhere that says he's legit or honest. And the fact that there's a hundred other pages just like his with the exact same come on the same brand kit and the same build out as this whole thing that looks like Shopify just put together and reached out to people. That's what it is. And like I said, unfortunately, he couldn't come through on the backside. He just sucked at it. So anyway, that's my thing on Mr. Roman Papel. Bye.